okay so for the head we are going to use the skin color and we are going to start with six single crochet into the magic ring so I already did that so now in the second row we are going to increase each stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we're going to increase and then we're going to in continue increasing and increase Okay, so now in our third row, okay, in our third row, we are going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And then continue repeating that single crochet and increase okay and you're going to repeat the same pattern all the way round okay so now in our fourth row we're going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two and increase and we're going to keep repeating that to a single crochet and increase okay and repeat that all the way round okay so now in our fifth row we are going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three and increase in the next stitch and then we're going to keep repeating that so three single crochets and increase okay and continue like that all the way round okay so now in our sixth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 36 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four and increase and we'll keep repeating that so four single crochets and increase okay so repeat the same all the way round okay so now in the seventh row we are going to do five single crochet then increase and repeat all the way for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and increase Then repeat that so five single crochets three four five 
and increase okay and repeat that all the way round okay so after that now in the eighth row we are going to do six single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 48 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five six and then increase and repeat that six single crochets one two three four five six and increase Okay, so repeat that all the way round after that so now for the next nine rows which is from row 9 until row 17 we are going to do single crochet in each row for a total of 48 stitches in each row okay so do single crochet all the way round for the next nine rows and then I'll see you when you're done with the 17th row so that we start the 18th row together Okay, so guys after the 17th row this is how our head looks like so now in our 18th row we are going to start decreasing and we're going to do six single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five okay six and then decrease and then we're going to keep repeating that so six single crochet one two three four five six and decrease okay and you're going to keep repeating that all the way round okay so now in our 19th row we are going to do five single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 36 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and then decrease and then we're going to keep repeating that so five single crochet two three four Five and decrease okay and you're going to keep repeating that all the way round okay so after that now in our 21st row we are going to do four single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way for a total of 30 stitches so we do single crochet one two three four and decrease and then we keep repeating that so four single crochets one two three four and decrease Okay, and we'll repeat that all the way round okay so now in our 22nd row uh, we're going to do three single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way for a total of 24 stitches 
so we'll do single crochet one two three and decrease and then we'll keep repeating that so three single crochets then decrease okay and keep repeating that all the way round okay so now you'll start stuffing your head as we go because we are almost finished so in the 23rd row we are going to do two single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet one and then single crochet two and decrease and then we'll keep repeating that okay so two single crochet and decrease okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way round so now in our 24th row we're going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 12 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet then decrease And we'll keep repeating that single crochet then decrease okay and you're going to repeat the same pattern all the way to the end okay so after that now uh, you're going to stuff your head fully and now in our last row which is our 25th row we are going to decrease in all the way round okay so we're going to decrease six times so one two three four five and one last time six okay so after that you're just going to cut off your yarn long enough for sewing and i'm going to slip stitch okay and then we'll be done with the head Okay, so now for the fish tail or the mermaid tail, we are going to start by doing a chain 10. So we'll do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Okay, and then we are going to take the other end and join. Okay, so we're going to join over here and I'm going to place my marker okay so after that we are going to do single crochet all the way around for a total in each chain for a total of 10 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet single crochet and you continue all the way round so you'll have a total of 10 stitches
okay so after you get here to this end now from the next row which is the second row until the fourth row we are going to keep increasing in each stitch all the way round okay so we'll have a total of 20 stitches so you're going to increase in the next stitch and increase in the next stitch also okay and you're going to keep increasing in every stitch all the way round okay so keep increasing all the way round and also in the next two rows which is row three and row four you're going to keep increasing in every stitch of in every row all the way around okay so this row you'll have 20 stitches in the third row you'll have 40 stitches and in the fourth row which is the last row you'll have 60 stitches okay so i'll see you when you're done and then uh, we'll see how it's gonna look like and then we're going to join all the parts together okay guys so after we're done with the fish tail this is how it looked like so in the second row we have a total of 20 stitches in the third row we have 40 stitches and in the last row we have 80 stitches okay so we're going to attach it here at the bottom like that okay and after that i'll show you how to join all the parts together okay so guys as you can see i've already finished attaching all the parts together okay so what i've done it's quite easy to attach because we only had to attach the head and the little tail so what i did is i just uh i just uh used my needle to attach the head and down here also i attached the little tail as you can see so this is how it's supposed to look like okay so the right side is supposed to face up as you can see and the wrong side down okay and for the hair i used some extension it's the top bun extension so it comes with this string to pull as you can see just like the way you put it when you're wearing the bun you just put it over the head of the doll and uh, you can use the needle to attach it all the way around as you can see as you can see it's quite long so I wanted it long enough but I think I'm going to cut it a little bit okay and also to make your head firm you can put a little wire a little pipe inside to make it firm i didn't do it with mine yet but um i think i'm gonna leave it like that okay so guys i hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you have any question you can ask in the comments below and also please subscribe and check out my other videos until next time bye